So what's up guys? Welcome to Raffles Garage. As you can see, today we're working on the Corolla. Um, haven't given it a wash, so it's gonna get a nice little detailed from the inside out. And I'm also gonna install an amp. By the way, that's Rocky, that's my brother's dog. And that's Turbo's dad. So, back to it. I'm gonna install an amp and a sub since Corolla already has all the wiring going back over there. Um, it does have like four wires or power wires. I'm gonna remove three of them, just gonna keep one. That system was belonged to GT4, and since I sold it, it was gonna go on Evo, but Evo's not running up right now, so Corolla it is, since it's gonna be my daily. Um, I might install this bat today, maybe tomorrow, I don't know. I gotta wait for the hardware. Mark has it, so I gotta wait on that. And I'm actually gonna install these. Um, they're a little bit better than the ones that I have. And because the guy broke them when he ran all the wire from the amps. I don't know why he ran three of them. But it's cracked right here. Doesn't it's not even fitting right because look at this. We got one, two, three, four power power wires. Same thing with this one. This one's not cracked, but if you take it off. Basically, these got bent and they're not that great anymore. So I just got new, I got used ones from the junkyard. And as you can see, this interior is dirty. So I'm gonna go walk around of how dirty it is and do the before and after. See all the wire that's here only one of them goes all the way in the back or actually two so i don't know what this guy was thinking but this is a mess you got spacers i see a sock down there but it's dirty let's clean it up and maybe fix all this right here then i don't even know what this is right here but I gotta fix all this stuff. And then this is the spat is missing. So I gotta install that. And then let's move this car up and start working on it. So I'll give you a little quote start. Let's start by removing all this stuff that we don't need from here, all this junk, and then the wire, see this was the one I'm going to keep, this is the thickest one, and then clean it up before I put on the sub, so let's get to it. So let's put on some gloves, I usually don't wear gloves, but with this whole pandemic and how dirty this car is I'm gonna use them let's get back to it so there it is took all the stuff out of there that's all we got most of it is drunk it's a spare got a carpet at least and then Oh, these zip ties I took off. So let's start working on the side over here. I'm probably only gonna use this short one right here, but I'm gonna test fit it before I, you know, remove everything out. So 
not sure which one I'm gonna keep maybe only one works uh, probably all that wire too I don't know what it was I'm gonna remove it also and then this wire also only thing I'm gonna keep is the positive and grounds and that's it and these two right here making sure they work hopefully these work so let's get to it so this is why i like removing the seats out of any new car i get um except for the hellcats brand new so you already know it's clean but look how much shit is on under the seats man i'm gonna take off these two on both of them it's probably only like two like four four boats 14s or 12s so i'm gonna remove those seats too so i can get a better um so i'm able to clean it better So Mark showed up. He's gonna help me detail it, and and, <laughs> and um, probably see what's up with this wiring for the oh, AM. You got a sick ass fucking headset. Fuck my AirPods. I'm gonna use this one now. <laughs> Damn. So gotta replace the little things. I gotta put a light right there. That one's not working. And then connect the audio for the sub. <laughs> Fingers got cut right there. We already Super took all of them. Papa. Nah. <laughs> we just gotta connect this to there through the wire. Hey, what's hey. doing? <laughs> all that wire right there was in the Corolla. Oh, okay. strip and sell it. Weight reduction. Oh, wait, wait. oh, and it's been that full. Mark, don't drop that one small screw in the center console. It's extra weight in my car. <laughs> like looking a lot better. Now I only have a power, ground, and Negative. Audi, uh, audio uh, and the uh, Ampire. Ampire. Damn, on. baby got tint on the Hellcat. It's about fucking time. By time, a month, a month, like two months later, bro. Two months, <laughs> two months later. Two months, hey, baby, why didn't you tint the windshield too? Hey, for real. Stop knocking. You're knocking. Yeah, but like it looks hella hey, nice. Get, get hey, inside. get inside. Get inside. But yesterday we kind of cleaned it up a little bit um it got dark so i wasn't able to do much but most of it's already clean i just have to shampoo it i ordered a vacuum for it um stereo is working sub isn't working i think it's because of my stereo the touch screen doesn't work so i can't turn on the sub but the amp turns on uh just the sub doesn't um do anything but i still gotta go to the junkyard and get one of these that one was burnt also so yeah i still gotta figure out what that switch is for that one right there and it goes to the aem air fuel so i gotta lift up the car and see where what it does but i'm just gonna put everything back together and then wait until i get the shampoo machine so i could shampoo it
all the junk the Corolla had. You know, that's a lot. Weight reduction. So she's all clean from the inside. Not to take care of all this dirt and gunk it has. This is the end result. Still need to detail it, but just gave it a quick little wash.